<coughs> Afternoon, morning, wherever you are. Um, so, you're about to see uh, some of my daft way of living. Um, I keep spending money on ridiculous things, normally cars, guitars, other stuff that you shouldn't really spend money on during a pandemic. Um, yeah, welcome to my life. I'm going to be sharing a couple of stories and adventures with you over the next couple of weeks. Maybe try and post a couple of videos a month. See what you think. Enjoy. I got like too involved in like the process of looking for a car and wanting a car and then looking to buy a car. I was on Auto Trader for like ages and ages and ages just scrolling and scrolling on eBay scrolling and scrolling and scrolling looking at all these like r totally ridiculous vehicles I'll never be able to afford anything like what I was looking at so um I bought something I bought uh, I bid 666 because metal I bid 666 pounds I got it for 665 pounds <laughs> so whether it was meant to be it was meant to be that's a sign right that's a sign good morning facebook instagram um i've bought a new car so that's nothing new that happens my dad has agreed to give me a lift from southampton back to london and then onto the car tomorrow for petrol money. Now, that sounds like a good deal for me. My dad drives an electric car. You see where I'm going with this. <laughs> like, has he just agreed to do this for free? Because I don't know what to do. I'm gonna leave it up to you to decide. Should I pay dad, like, or my dad, petrol money for an electric car? <laughs> like, or not? I'm gonna put a poll here. Um, it's up to you guys and uh, I'll let him know the results. I should explain at this point, my dad is the most patient person in the world, but he's had to deal with me for 33 years. I've moved out, obviously, because adult. Probably going to speed it up. Central travel only. You see that sign? <laughs> yeah. I checked the history of the vehicle um, after I bought it, and then <laughs> like uh, I, I checked it. You know, I made sure it was like you know working and that. But.
So quick disclaimer here. Buying cars as a hobby is fucking stupid. You shouldn't do it. I shouldn't do it. But you shouldn't do it. I can't be an influencer like for you guys. Like I'm a bad influencer. Do the opposite of what I do. That should be like ways to live by. Like don't do what I do. Like So yeah, we'll get the car, um, drive as far back before it breaks down as possible. Um, I don't know how to use the breakdown cover from the insurance yet, and they're shut. <laughs> I know I've got it, I know I've bought it, but I don't know how that works. I think I might need to learn. Yeah, well, just sit in the car. Like, so I've got to ask him first. Sit in the car. But because the generation game was still doing so well, I always replied I wasn't going to leave. And Michael always repeated that if I changed my mind, I could do anything I liked for ITV. If you do leave, he always concluded, we'd make you very welcome, Bruce. I hated refusing him. Just going to put my mask on because of COVID. Mm-hmm. Do I have to do anything? You want me to do anything else with this, or are you, are you done with this? Uh, what's that? Because you can't shoot video him if you don't. Yeah, I've got to speak to him about it, obviously. But... Yeah, could could you film him? Uh, we're just going to pull back. I'm going to be in the back of it. Right. You... And uh, it's you... the last. Last ride of uh, Pawnee's taxi. <laughs> My first taxi driver. <laughs> 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 Taxi. Dad's taking me. He's done nothing other than mine. <laughs> what did the guy say to you at the end? He shouldn't really do more than 60 mile an hour on the motorway. If you start doing 70 mile an hour constantly on the motorway, yeah, yeah. it knocks him out a little bit yeah. quicker. I'll let him know. Nice one, mate. Cheers, see you later. <laughs> nothing. <laughs> what did he say? He said stick to 60, don't go over 70. <laughs> so, uh, so we're going to be uh, going to <laughs> <plus. laughs> like, well, I'm glad he told you, but I don't know, I, I don't think it's going to be a problem, but I've got breakdown cover. <laughs>
Breakdown cover, yay! If you really didn't like the video, hit the dislike button twice, so I really get the message. So, I lost the memory card with the intro and the outro and some other footage that will become apparent through this. I was going to reshoot it, but I'll just give you an explanation of what it was at the time. Um, we got a couple of bits shot already, um, but filming the intro and the outro, I've gone through this. I have no idea what I'm doing, so I'm not like a filmmaker guy. Like, I have no skills in pretty much any area to do with this. Literally, I just buy ridiculous things. That's a skill. Drunken eBay. Every time I do one of these, I end up with something else. Like, I mean, look, look around, it's already drunken eBay. But we moved on from physical little things that we can just sort of pick up and play with to cars. So we're now buying cars, we're now buying thousand pound guitars. What am I doing? Like, what am I doing? I, I need to get some sort of a new hobby. Buying cars is not a hobby. It shouldn't be a hobby, but it's become one. So, um... Yeah, I just watched uh, Man United stuff Southampton, which is quite funny. Like, last minute goal. That's going to really date this video. But that's what I'm watching on the TV just there as I'm trying to talk to you. Um, so, 